Hi, it's Monica the Curvy Diva, and I'm here at the District Queens Happy Hour, which is their first event, and I am so excited about it. You guys should really be here. This is a fun event in the D District of Columbia, and they are here to highlight what's going on in the plus community and plus size fashion. So I'm going to go around and I'm going to talk to some of the queens and let you know who they are and learn about their blogs. one of the district queens. How are you this evening? I'm doing great. Thank great. You. <laughs> Can you tell me about your blog? Sure. My blog is Enjoy Curves. Um, Enjoy Curves, but the blog is Joy of Curves. And basically what it's about is the lifestyle blogging and it's a talk about fashion, travel, and different products that the female uses. So it's just to show a well-rounded about different sizes and how to use different products as far as, you know, female products, undergarments, and different clothing. All right, that sounds interesting. I like that you added travel in there because so many blogs are just about fashion or just about lifestyle, but you have a little bit of everything. Right, right. So the traveling piece really comes about because I'm originally from Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Oh, wow. And so I travel back and forth and as well as, you know, go to different cities. So this just adds a little expertise to it as well as showing different clothing because what we may wear here in D.C. may not work well within um, the DMV area. Well, you know. I mean, within Florida, I'm sorry. <laughs> Well, you know, we have our own style. We're like in the middle, so yeah. we do our own thing here. <laughs> Literally in the middle. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Thank I'm you. loving the event. Thank and you so much. Make sure you follow her. Give them your handle again. My handle is Enjoy Curves. All right. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Hey, I'm back with one of the district queens. This is Tiffany of Policy and Fashion. So tell me a little bit about your blog. Um, so my blog is a career and style blog. So what we're looking to do is combine not only how to be fashionable and chic in the workplace, but also give ladies strategic tips on how to navigate the workplace. Right, and I love the name of your blog, Policy, like DC, yes. like is that DC yes. Policy Political like Bill. DC. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Being flair with your workplace fashion, being fashionable, being chic. So that's how I kind of combine like the serious policy with fashion. Right. I love it. I love it. So, what are you looking to do to, with working with District of Queens? What is your like hopes and aspirations for the group? So, District Queens, I just feel like it's amazing opportunity for us to just collaborate. I feel like as a blogger, it was a lot of people when I started out didn't want to partner. They didn't necessarily want to right. collaborate. So, our goal is to really show that collaboration works. And particularly for black women, we can work collaboratively. We can have individual goals. We can have collective goals. And just using our following to kind of push our all of our agendas forward. Right. I like that, too, because that's showing, you know, that you guys are inspiring each other. And that's an inspiration for anyone else trying to work. I mean, collaboration helps because you all can help boost each other's careers. Definitely. And then we can you go to brands like you have all of us. Yes, so. that's right. That's right. You're right. So what brands are you looking to work with in the area? Um, oh my goodness. Well, we love Eloquine. They know they, we love them as well. So these are some of our pictures just with all totally with just their brand. Um, me personal goals, I love Target. I love Old Navy. So I'm all about how to make the everyday woman be fashionable. So it may not necessarily always be luxury brands but how to do the look for less and still look great I like that thank you so much and I'm having so much fun at this event thank the cake you. was amazing <laughs> you guys are, should be upset you're not here we'll see you guys next time that's right look out for more of their events thank you so much yeah. Tiffany thank you. hi I'm here with another one of the district queens this is Yaya and the name of her blog is randomly Yaya so tell us a bit about your blog so it's a lifestyle blog. I really like to travel and cook. And I also talk about my love-hate relationship with the gym because it's not to stay in shape, but I hate the gym. So I do a lot of cooking. I try to do meal planning to at least eat healthy if I'm not in the gym all the time. Right. And I like that you have the cooking and the hate for the gym thing. Because I'm sorry, as much as we love to eat, food is good. But I mean, the gym, we've got to get there. We've got to stay healthy. So it's good that you're showing some inspiration like, uh, I hate it, but I got to do it. I like to bake. Uh -huh. So I bake a lot. Chicken is my favorite thing, so I'm always making chicken. I recently made chicken that had on top, it was like a um, cream spinach. Wow. 
Oh, that sounds good. But then on top, it also had um, roasted tomatoes, uh -huh. and then it also had uh, pepper jack cheese, and then bacon bits on top. So are you like looking at different restaurants or any of the events happening here? Are you blogging about those as well? I am, yeah. I try to go to food events. I try to do like food tours in D.C., check out the new restaurants that have recently opened and get inspired by those as well. Like I like to cook and I also like to eat, so I do a little bit of both. Okay, and about the gym. What gym are you visiting? Where are you going to get that workout in? So I used to work at L.A. Fitness, actually, so I have an L.A. Fitness membership. So they haven't seen me in a while, don't tell anybody, but yeah. <laughs> All right, well, thank you, everyone. Look out for Randomly Yaya. Check out what she's talking about with food, with working out, her struggles, her, her, um, her, like, her inspiration, and all of that great stuff. So thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. Hey, I'm here with Vivi, and she's here at the fabulous happy hour with me. And she has a blog as well. It's Heart Print and Style. So, Vivi, tell us what got you started blogging, what you've been, what's been going on with you in the DMV? Sure. Um, I've been blogging for the past seven years. Um, October will make it seven. I started badly because I was laid off, so I just needed another outlet to express myself. Well, that's how some of us start, though. It's like it's, they say in your darkest hour, all the light comes. So that's wonderful. I like that. So it, it came about that, and also because um, my sister kind of pushed me. She was like, oh, I have style. Let me just try to get into this plus size. Because at the time, there was not a lot of plus size bloggers, and especially here in DC. And also, especially me being Nigerian American. Because, you know, so she was just like, no, this is it. You know, you found your, yeah. your spot. So I was just like, uh, so I, I kind of held it off for almost a year. Because I was just like, let me just figure out how it's going right now with like the Gabby Freshes and the um, other bloggers out there. So right, once. Right. That came about and I saw how it was working. I thought, okay, I can do this. And then I just started and here we are. So, yeah. <laughs> so what have you liked about it? What have you seen in the DMV? Like how we're kind of coming into the plus size realm on the East Coast? Well, I was just um, um, talking to some of the girls and I was just saying how it was, in the beginning, it was hard to find DC, like a DC plus size community right. online. Yeah. So out there. But they're not online. So it was hard to reach out to them. But I think right. thanks to social media, Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest, all that, the hashtags, you know, the girls could get to see it and be like, oh, wow, we're all out here. There is a community of us. Right, that's right, right. right. Together, so, yeah. 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 So uh, thank you so much. I love that you're here. Thank you. Everyone, follow her blog. Yeah, Tell them. Sal. Oh, okay. <laughs> Heart print and style, um, Instagram heart print and style. Yeah, I'm here. So, yeah. all right, follow her, show her some love. Thank you so much, Thank Vivian. You. Whatever, we can get a dance song. I was gonna say, we were just over here doing We can pop it right quick. Hey. <laughs> all right, now I got a little low line going with my ladies, a plus in the DMV. Hey. All right, now. How you doing, ladies? Good, how are you? All right, so can you guys introduce yourself to me? I am Shayla Victoria. All right, and, and I'm Jamie. So Shayla and Jamie are the ladies of Plus in the DMV, and they also have their own things going on. So can one of you ladies tell me about Plus in the DMV? Shayla. Oh, okay, Shayla. We're going to talk. Look, we're going to toss it back over. I mean, right. Molly did right to me. Um, Plus in the DMV was birthed out of two women who are in love and with style and fashion, but we felt there was a deficit with Plus um, events, and there was really a fracture in the Plus community. So right. what we're trying to do with our podcast is bring all the ladies together. I mean, it's so important to form a strong Plus unit and a strong Plus community, and that's what we're here to do. We just want to bring the ladies together. Yes, we do. And I love that you guys have a podcast. And I'm seeing so many people here tonight that do so many different things in the Plus community. And to have us all here together just celebrate. I love it. Don't you love it? It's, it's a movement. It's a movement. And it's palpable when we all get together. You can feel how things are changing and shifting. It's exciting. I'm yeah, and I'm glad we have it here in the DMV. So. <laughs> so, Jamie, like, why, why, you know, why should they come to the DMV and learn about the fashion that we have here? Because um, we have fun here. <laughs> 
Um, yeah, I think, um, as I was explaining to the other ladies earlier, there's a lane here. And there are a lot of um, women in this area that really want to see things happen here for us. Um, and like you said, there's a lot of togetherness here. There's a lot of unity. There's a lot of positivity in this area. And there's a lot of love. So we're here for it. We're here to build it. And if you build it, they will come. That's right. Hey. That's right. So you ladies also have your own personal brands that you are working on. So I'd love to hear about that. Shayla, come on, let me know. So my, my personal um, my personal brand or IG is The Vein Life. It's just basically my take on style, my take on fashion, my take on daily life. And that's just that's just what I'm doing. I'm more focused on plus in the DMV right now. That's the baby. Like that's just that's what we're really focused on. But you know, that's a little side thing. A little side thing. Hey, we can all have our little side little gig. Side thing, right? <laughs> all right. Come on, Jamie. Mine is uh, Fashion Maybe. Um, and I named it that because it was to kind of journal my journey into plus size fashion um, to find out what works for me um, with my lifestyle and with my curves um, but like Shayla said I think we have a lot of amazing bloggers um, just in the plus community period so yeah, we wanted we to kind of do something a little different um, so we wanted to kind of go the podcast route and to kind of bring the curvy community into your living room into your earphones into you know wherever you are and have just some curvy girl shoot chat yeah. so, that's our baby I love it. I love it. So, what are some of the topics on the show? Oh, we just did dating. We just oh, did gosh, dating. the dating game. Oh my God. Dating, um, and we talked about the struggles in plus size dating. Um, some of the stereotypes with plus size dating. Um, we tackled some real, real issues. Real issues. I love it. I love it. So, how can people listen in? Do they listen in live, or do you re-record? We record right now. We're on SoundCloud. Um, we're in the process of getting it up on iTunes. Um, okay. But right now you can find us on SoundCloud and there's a link in our IG on uh, Plus in the DMV on Instagram and it'll take you right there. All right. Well, I'm loving what you all what you all are doing. Everyone, make sure you check out Plus in the DMV. Listen to them on SoundCloud. Support them so they can get on iTunes and show the world what's going on in this community in the DMV area and what these ladies are doing with Plus in the DMV and what they're doing individually. And I love all of that. Bring it here. We was getting our groove on. But make sure you listen to them. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Hey, I'm here with another one of the district queens. I'm here with Yasmin, and the name of her blog is Dark of the Berry, right? Dark of the Berry, sweet of the juice, honey. So that means that blog is extra sweet. I love it. I love it. So tell me a little bit about your blog. So my blog is a fashion and lifestyle blog, so I, I cover um, everything fashion and I try to mix in a lot of um, African prints and African um, fashion into it because I'm from Benin, which is a West African country, so I really try to incorporate that into my blog. And then I talk a lot about like lifestyle topics such as dating and just trying to like find yourself and figure out yourself in the world. Right, I like that because it's like within the fashion, you're date you want to look good when you're going out on dates. Exactly. So some I gotta find a man. <laughs> I love it. And finding yourself also. Fashion is like that expression of who you are. Exactly. So one day you might feel a certain way, the next day you feel another way. So and, and so that's pretty, pretty much what the blog is about, right? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma yes, that's right. what it is. So what do you see happening with the District Queens? I know this is you all's first event. What's coming up? So there is so much potential with um, with what we can do because this is the first time that you know we're all coming together, we're collaborating, we're in the same city. So we're really about to take DC, you know, we're about to take DC by storm. We're, we have a lot of other events planned. We want to actually go to other events together, such as CurvyCon, which is a huge event. Oh, I cannot wait till CurvyCon, yes, in New York. So we really want to also not only over take over DC, but also take over New York and. Just really kind of just like navigate this plus size blogger world and just kind of show that women can come together and and just like collaborate and, and just do great together. Like we don't always have to be catty and be, you know, picky. Yes. Like we can come together and create amazing things together. Right. And I love the queens part of the name because we yes. are queens in our own world. Like seriously, you guys are like cleaning it up tonight. <laughs> I lo I'm loving all of you all's outfits. Where is this skirt from? So my skirt is Eloquie and my top is Forever 21. Yes, I love the mix match of the brands. Yes, and we do have both 
in the area, so that's great that you can go to the stores. And I'm so happy that Eloquy decided to bring a store here in the DC area. Like it is great to, because you know sometimes when you're shopping online, you can be unsure about the size that you are. Yes. That's, oh my God. I'm in between sizes. Sometimes I'm a 14. Sometimes I'm a 16. Sometimes I'm even an 18, depending on how the material is. Right. So it's really nice to have a physical store here that you can go to, right. try on a bunch of things, and it's great. It's almost like you have to know how the store kind of cuts their clothes on their fit models. Exactly. Like, do they cut a little tighter? Do they cut a little looser? Is the fabric going to loosen up when I wear it and wash it? Right, right. So, right. Those, I mean, those are great things to learn about in different with different bloggers. So, I'm glad we have this in the DMV. This event has been popping all night. I'm loving it. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you. Thank you for having it. And I can't wait till the other events. Make sure you're following the District Queen so you can know what's going on with them in the DMV with their events. Thank you so much. Jasmine. Thank you. All right, have a good time. All right, thank you. All right. So I am here with all of the district queens right now. Oh my gosh, y'all event is popping though. Loving, loving, loving this. Ladies, thank you so much for having this event and starting us off with a bang with all these lovely plus events in the area. So can you ladies just tell me, what is District, district Queens about? District Queens is about a collaboration of four bloggers coming together to really just put out the plus size world in the DC area. All right, all right. And what do we have to look forward to again, ladies? There's a plethora of events that's coming up um, as far as like um, we're doing a sale event, we're doing a Christmas event, and also working with self, um, various brands, and also just collaborate with other plus size bloggers and other people within the DMV area. All right, and what do you guys hope to see, you know, come of District Queens and the fashion and, like, the different things in the environment with models, with photographers, with everyone involved in the whole plus industry in the DMV? Just really pushing collaboration and saying that you can work together. We all may have different things that we want to do, but together, collectively, we can push each other forward and all be successful. And so do you guys kind of feel like this is this is like their baby, even though you all have your own separate brands, this is your baby, right? It is, it's totally our baby, yeah. We want it to grow, we want people to love it and come see us and support, yeah, it's totally our baby. Totally, totally the baby, right? I love it. I can't wait to see what comes. I mean, like I said, this event has been so much fun to have like a little spot on U Street and just coming after work just to drink, just to eat, have fun and fellowship and just talk about what's going on in the industry because we have so much going on. But you need to be here in the DMV. We got some stuff popping. We got some stuff popping. And we have great people behind it. And you all are part of that great brand that we're building in the DMV area. So ladies, thank you once again. Thank you so much.